Galling is a serious disruption in the operation of threaded fasteners. It causes part damage and costly delays throughout heavy industry every single day. You've probably seen it yourself. You start to disassemble the joint by backing the nut off, and then suddenly, the nut is stuck and the bolt is seized. It's more than just high friction or debris in the threads. It's like the parts have fused together. Fusing into one part is exactly what happened. However, the nut and bolt didn't melt together from friction and heat like a friction weld. Galling isn't a result of phase change because nothing gets hot enough to enter a liquid state. Rather, the fusion is driven by adhesion and deformation. The distinction might seem pedantic, but it's critical to informing effective preventative steps. If you want to stop galling, you need to know how it happens. To the naked eye, the nut and bolt look like two smooth surfaces of metal in continuous contact, creating an evenly distributed load. But when we zoom in at a microscopic level, we see imperfections. The surfaces of the threads have high points and low points. When a nut is turned on a bolt, what looks like an evenly distributed load is concentrated on these high points, or asperities, creating areas of tremendous localized stress. This stress exceeds the strength of the opposing material, allowing the asperities to break through the protective oxide layer to the bulk metal underneath. As the two parts continue to move, material must plastically flow around the asperity. Metal builds up at the penetration site, thereby forming a lump and increasing the rate of plastic deformation. This material deformation generates heat. You can recreate the phenomenon of material deformation generating heat yourself by bending a metal paper clip back and forth until the bend itself heats up. As the nut turns, more of the brittle oxide layer is scraped away, exposing more ductile base metal in direct, high-energy contact and resulting in larger and larger lumps. Eventually, enough ductile base metal is in contact under such high-energy state that the nut and bolt start forming metallic bonds. They have become one part, as these bonds are no different than the metallic bonds throughout the rest of the structure. This is why, once a nut is galled, the only way to get it off is to cut or torch it. The safest and most cost-effective way to deal with galling is to prevent it altogether. So, how do we prevent it? The solution right for you is a balance of cost and effectiveness depending on your budget and how critical your application is. Hydraulic tensioning or hydraulic nuts are effective solutions but they are also the most expensive and overkill for most applications. Lubrication is the cheapest alternative, but it only helps with assembly, before being broken down or expelled after years of service, long before disassembly. Using different material types for nuts and bolts can reduce their ability to fuse together, but it's not an option for every setup and won't always prevent galling in any case. The easiest and most reliable option is to use velocity washers. As we've seen, galling is a process that requires mechanical and thermodynamic milestones to be met. The torque applied to turn the nut under load is the sole source of energy input. This energy drives the galling process through localized yielding, lump formation and growth, oxide layer penetration, deformation and heat generation, and eventual bond formation. With only 12 degrees of rotation, the velocity washer simply stops the galling process from advancing past the initial stages by limiting the energy input. So, deformation is minimized, oxide layers remain intact, lumps don't form, and heat and energy don't build up enough to form bonds. Instead of having to break out the torches and splitters, you're simply on to the next flange. So while galling is a serious and costly disruption throughout heavy industry, it doesn't have to stay that way. Stop trying to mitigate the effects of galling with specialty teams and built-in delays. With Velocity Washer, you can prevent it altogether. Velocity Bolting. We engineer solutions that accelerate industrial bolting operations.